get into, I need all the ladies to take a stretch. Get a stretch, man. <laughs> stretch the blue. Stretch the blue. Get your position, now, y'all. Get your position. We about to get real athletic in this motherfucker. Hey, you ready? Keep the party going. Let's go, man. Man, I just got finished watching that. I loved it. I'm one of the biggest juvenile fans in the world. I done went to see him a couple times, man. Uh, if you haven't seen it, Juvenile and Manny Fresh Tiny Desk Concert is up on YouTube right now, man. Let's get into some more news. But oh, man, in other news, I'm going to try my best not to hold y'all up too long. But you know what today is, right? It's New Music Friday. What we listening to? Suggest me something. So, boom, peep this out. It looks like the World Health Organization is to declare the sweetener and Diet Coke a possible carcinogen. A.K.A. it got shit in it that can give you cancer. So, everybody that was drinking that thing and they were fixing to lose weight. Get your fat ass up and go out here and run. Ooh, look like I got a new fear unlocked, but it looks like a woman loses her leg after it gets trapped in the airport walkway. Man, my lazy ass always take this shit in the airport. Damn, ain't no way I did a little war like that, man. But it looks like Sexy Red cuts her Summer Smash performance short after people in the audience repeatedly throwing things at her. Y'all seen it? What's even worse is, I don't know if they was cheering because they enjoyed her and they felt sorry for her, Oh, they were happy that her ass was getting off the stage, man. Damn. But it nasty. But an accused child rapist, Jeremy Guthrie, was pulled over for a DUI with six kids in his car and claimed that they're his friends. Friends? Cheering? Yeah. Damn, man. Looks like them student loans won't be forgave after all. They, they just won't fucking stop. But it looks like Ocean Gate is still reportedly advertising the expeditions to see the Titanic wreckage. Go ahead and go. The people on that Titanic gonna be waiting for you just like this. Damn. So it looks like the Supreme Court rules businesses can discriminate against LGBTQ. This is crazy. But so is the rent in New York. But we're going to get into that in a little bit later in this video. But the population in homeless shelters in NYC reaches 100K for the first time. Who the fuck they think they is? Spartacus or some shit? But Mark Zuckerberg and Elon Musk might fight at the Coliseum in Rome. Man, and this sucks something bad right here. But it looks like ESPN, first off, I think they trying to like cut costs, save money, something. But ESPN lays off high profile sports commentators, including Jalen Rose and Keyshawn Johnson, amongst others, bro. I don't know about everybody else, but I know it was over for Jalen and his buttery lineup after I seen this. Yes, sir. Happy birthday and belated birthday to our boy Charlemagne the God, Nicole Shrell Zinger, I think, David Allen Greer, the late great Lena Horn, Iron Mike Tyson, our girl Fantasia, Tony Rock, and our boy DJ Pooh. Yes, sir. This same day yesterday, June 29, 2004, our boy Lloyd Banks debuts with The Hunger for More. I still jam that album. This same day yesterday, June 29, 2001, the classic movie Baby Boy is released in theaters. This same day today, June 30th, 2017, our boy Jay-Z, yep, he releases Fo Fo Fo. And on this day right here, June 30th, 1989, Spike Lee presents Do the Right Thing, the movie. This is excellence right here. But our girl Rihanna becomes the first female artist to have 10 songs surpass the 1 billion streams in Spotify history, man. I know you think he was getting away. YNW Borland's double murder trial begins on October 2nd. This happened in my home state, of course, but multiple deputies fire after two men filed lawsuits alleging they entered their home illegally and tortured them for two hours. They said we done lost enough money. Anheuser Bush fires back after Dylan Muvena claims she was abandoned during Bud Light's backlash. I just reported that them businesses feel like they ain't gotta fuck with you no more. Okay, back to NYC and his big ass rent problems. But it looks like Mayor Adams goes off on a woman complaining about rent. Did y'all hear her? That was her. Now this is him. You gonna ask a question, don't point at me and don't do, be disrespectful to me. I'm the mayor of this city and treat me with the respect that I, I deserve to be treated. I'm speaking to you as an adult. Don't stand in front like you're treating someone that's on the plantation that you own. <laughs> 
But it went in, didn't he? He compared her to a motherfucking slave owner. But what's so bad is, though, her and her family fled from the Nazi regime years ago, man. And last but definitely not least, a photographer captures one of the largest great white sharks ever recorded. Have y'all seen it? You see how big that motherfucker is? You look in his mouth, you may find that submarine. Yes, sir. Tonight's weather, man. STL, St. Louis. Shouts out to y'all, man. Y'all always show love. Y'all 95 degrees, but y'all partly cloudy, big dog. In Frankfort, Connecticut. Shouts out to y'all, big homie. Y'all 86 degrees. Y'all mostly cloudy, man. Man, I stay lining, y'all. I say I ain't gonna be holding y'all up and stay holding y'all up, man. But if you're picking up what I'm putting down, make sure to also follow me on YouTube and Instagram, at News with Zay. Help me run them numbers up. Sorry for the last couple videos. It's been a recording of recording, but TikTok been making my shit lag so I said up oh, got something for your ass man but hey thank you for still watching and if you want me to shout out the weather report it's stupid fucking crazy easy man drop them shits in the comments you know I'm gonna take care of you hey it's Friday night y'all move like don't do nothing I wouldn't do and until next time family I'm a holly child man now when I do it twice now you know y'all gotta cut up harder now right I need y'all to get real athletic come on